What up YouTube, it's your boy Mikey B of Mikey B Cards here for another product review video. And today we have the all new 2019 Passing the Torch Football from Panini. These tiny little boxes, and believe me, they are small, contain five trading cards. Um, within that, we're gonna find three autographs per box. That's the uh, hits for this product. There are no relic cards. We're also gonna find a, I believe, a numbered parallel. And then I don't know if the base card is numbered as well, but we're gonna find out. So um, if you're not familiar with where these came from, Panini offered them on their website a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I believe, at least when I last looked last night, these are still available. So pretty surprising for a Panini product release to still be available on the website. Uh, days after release, let alone some of these products sell out within hours or minutes, um, we're going to find out what they're all about. So I think the exciting thing about this product is the fact that you get the three autographs. That's always great. More importantly, one in every four boxes contains a multiple autograph card. So to me, that makes this an ideal product to do for breaks. Um, something fun if you want to split some with some buddies or something like that. Uh, and you know, kind of go from there. Uh, the cost of the boxes was uh, was $150 each plus taxes. Uh, that's something new when you're buying stuff off of Panini's website. You get to pay uh, taxes as well. So, uh, you know, not the end of the world, but something to consider. Uh, but yeah, so as a breaker myself, I'm excited to be doing some breaks of this this week. Uh, this video is going to launch on a Tuesday on Wednesday uh friday and sunday i'll be doing breaks including passing the torch so i'm pretty excited to see what we have here let's uh, check it out let's check out the design let's see who we get hit wise and see if this is worth it i always love a new product um and i love a product that's autograph heavy so let's see who we get beautiful box and like i said it's really small about the size of panini black and look at that <laughs> One tiny little pack. <laughs> so it's actually, it's about the size and look of like a white sparkle pack. So, but yeah, there's only five cards in it. So I'm not sure what the order is. Typically a base or numbered card would be on the back side. So I'll try to hide it a little bit, but it depends on how well this uh, pack wants to open for me. Let's see what these cards look like. I'm very, very curious. All right. So let's pull the back card. Yeah, the back card does not uh, is not an, a hit. So, all right. So here is the basic design. This is Barry Sanders, thirty of thirty-five. As you can tell, the cards are incredibly shiny. Have that prism look to them. I'm a big fan of that logo. I think that's a really cool logo. The PTT passing the torch. So nice short print here of Barry Sanders. Front of the card, like I said, looks really good. Back of the card, pretty standard uh, compared to most Panini products. Obviously, you got your stat line, little story, uh, statistics, and so forth. So this is pretty much what I would expect from any basic Panini product. Uh, but so far, I would say it looks really good. And always nice to hit Barry Sanders. Uh, let's see what's behind it. We have T.Y. Hilton. T.Y. Hilton, also a base card that is numbered. Let's see if the camera wants to... Wants to get it or not. Yeah, with the light. There we go. 6 of 60. Or is it 9 of 90? Ooh, that's a good question. I don't know. I'm going to say 6 of 60 just because it sounds better, even though I'm pretty sure that's wrong. <laughs> I think it's 09 of 90, but we have T.Y. Hilton for the Indianapolis Colts. And then it looks like we're going to go ahead and start the autographs. We should have three of them here. And our first one is Walter Jones, offensive tackle, and that's Torch Marks. Wow, look at that. Beautiful. 76 of 99. So there's the numbering down below. Now, from what I've seen, the vast majority of these cards are going to be stickers. I don't know if there's on-card autos. There could be. Um, I've only seen one uh, case break of this, and I believe it was all stickers. But overall design, beautiful. 
Beautiful cards. 55 point uh, top loads for those of you who are trying to prepare for like how to store these. And then behind it, we have for the Jets, the J E T S Jets, Jamal Adams. 54 of 99 Torchbearer signatures. So you see the. There we go. 54 of 99, Jamal Adams. And then, interestingly enough, we have a redemption. So, this should be a rookie autograph, I believe. And we got two veteran players there. So, when I do breaks, I always use my Batman card to cover up redemptions. So for those of you who have not seen the breaks, it's like, why on earth is he using that? I like to have a little fun with it. Usually it kind of takes a peek out there. <laughs> All right, so let's see what our redemption is. Rookie Evolution Autographs. Okay, so it's definitely going to be a rookie. There we go. And it's card number five, and we're going to see... All right, my boy, Noah Fant of the Denver Broncos. Sweet. That's a pretty cool card to me because Noah Fant was an Iowa guy. As you can tell, I have my Iowa thing in the background here. So always nice to get something of an Iowa player. So there we go. Got Noah Fant of the Denver Broncos, formerly of the Iowa Hawkeyes. That's going to be our rookie auto. Okay, so that was box number one. Now we have box number two. I did want to open two of these for the video versus just the standard one. Hopefully we've got some different design cards. can't get over how funny it is that there's just a little pack in the little box. I'll tell you what, I, I'm not opening the packs well. <laughs> okay, we have Mark Brunel, and it is a short print, 4 of 10. Mark Brunel, so two Jaguars cards coming out of uh, our two boxes. Interesting, usually Jaguars are a pretty inexpensive team in case breaks. I know they are in mine, so there you go. You know you can get some Jags cards. I believe the checklist, too, is up online right now, so if you guys want to see what autographs are in the product, go check that out. All right, then we have Patrick Mahomes, and that's going to be 40 of 60. So it looks like that T.Y. Hilton certainly was a out of 60. So Mahomes, I think with as well as Lamar Jackson's doing right now, everyone forgot just how good he is. Don't sleep on Mahomes. Ah, okay, we got another redemption. Interesting. All right. Green Bay Packers, Mason Crosby. 36 at 99, getting that kicker love. Torchbearer signatures for the Packers. And right behind that, this is so interesting. All right, I might have to change the pricing on my break. Apparently, the Jets are all over this thing. <laughs> Jamal Adams, again, 16 to 25 this time. So, Torchbearer Signatures, Jamal Adams. Let's, uh, real quick, since I've got them both here, let's take a look real quick between the different, uh, the different kinds. I'm going to start with the Jamal Adams uh, Rainbow. So this one's out of 99, this one's out of 25, and I mean, I'll, I'll tell you, just out of first glance, I don't really see a difference. So I guess I can analyze them a little, a little more closely, but cards look relatively the same. Let's grab Batman again. And redemption card number two. Apprentice Ink Gold. Okay, I like that. Not really sure what that means, but that sounds sweet. And it's card number eight. DK Metcalf for Seattle. Sweet. I'll have to look at the checklist to see what the Apprentice ink looks like and what gold is. Gold typically is going to be a shorter print. I don't know for a fact, but in most products it's out of 10, but uh, we'll find out for sure. I know they use a different naming convention for some other products, but 
pretty sweet. So, I mean, I will tell you this much of what the limited amount of what I've seen of this product, I would say it has been rare that both boxes had a redemption for the rookies. The case break that I watched did not have a single redemption. So maybe I just got lucky, but actually I'm okay with it because I like redemptions. I like putting those in and then having a surprise sometime in the future. Plus I kind of quasi PC Noah fan and I like DK Metcalf. So to me, those are actually two great cards. And then once again, you get some really cool veteran cards. Walter Jones, the two Jamal Adams, and Mason Crosby. So are they the biggest name players? Nope, but that's okay. Like I said, I think this is a phenomenal product to, if you want to purchase them yourself, take a shot, get one of the rookie autos, or maybe a solid veteran. I've seen some very sick autographs um, on the checklist uh, picture pages. And so forth but i think this is a product that is great to be break, uh, breaking with so grab your favorite team in a break um take a shot at it um and see if you can't get a couple autos from your team we didn't hit a multiple signature but that's okay um i would say so far pretty cool product i can't wait to open some of these tomorrow uh and see what we get out of that i think we're doing a case and a half uh, and then some more throughout the week. So if you're interested in that, I'll put the uh, stuff in the description as far as where you can find that. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Please make sure to like and subscribe. It really helps out the channel. And I'll be bringing, uh, I'll be bringing excuse me, some more content out here very soon. Uh, thank you for watching, everybody. It's Thanksgiving week, so make sure you have a wonderful Thanksgiving. And I'm going to go ahead and end this like I do with every video and say peace out. Have a good one.